Hello, my name is Nick Picard. I'm a software developer for DataLocker. Today, I'd like to talk to you about the added functionality and safety features you get from managing your encrypted USB drives using Iron Key EMS or DataLocker Safe Console. Now, what if one of your users loses their drive, or worse, you no longer trust the person who has a device? Using your management solution, there's additional steps you can take to make sure your data doesn't fall into the wrong hands. After all, isn't that the very reason why you've purchased encrypted drives in the first place? Using Safe Console, the administrator has the possibility of remotely wiping a device. Let's see how it's done. First thing you'll have to do, find the device. And then there's a few options available to you. You can disable the device, which will leave the data intact, but prevent the user from unlocking the drive, even if they have the right password. This is a temporary state that can be undone. But if you need something more robust, you can issue a factory reset. This will wipe the data and bring the device back into out-of-the-box state so that it can be reused again. As you can see, the status has been updated to waiting for reset, meaning that the next time the user plugs in the device, it will contact Safe Console, which will issue the command. Now let's take a look at what will happen the next time the user plugs in their device. Run the software. The data is already wiped, and we're busy resetting it back to out-of-the-box state. And there you have it. The user can now reuse the device as if it was brand new. Using EMS, the administrator has the ability of remotely wiping a device. Let's see how it's done. First, you'll need to find the device. And from here, there's a few options available to you. You can disable the device, which will leave the data intact, but prevent any user from accessing the content. This is a temporary operation that can be undone by clicking Re-enable. For a more permanent solution, you can click on Recommission, which will wipe the data and bring the device back into out-of-the-box state. Here we can see the status has been set to Pending Recommission, meaning it will take effect the next time the device contacts EMS. And this is what your user will see the next time they plug in their device. Launch the software. Try and unlock. At this point, the data is already gone, and we're busy resetting the device back to factory state. As you can see, the device has been recommissioned, and the device will behave as if it was brand new.